we do have three-year follow-up with the Checkmate Non-LA trial as of ASCO 2022. Very encouraging. We already described the patient population. These are patients with advanced and metastatic non-small cell lung cancer, regardless of histology or PDL1. So even PDL1 negative patients. And we see that the overall survival at three years is 27% for the patients who were treated with chemotherapy plus nivolumab and ipilimumab versus 19% for those patients who are treated with chemotherapy alone. We also got a chance to see subpopulations of patients. So that's looking at their PDL1 expression. So patients who have PDL1 negative disease, 25% of them still alive at three years versus 15% in patients who had chemotherapy alone. And then PDL1 greater than or equal to 1%. Um, those patients, 28% of them with NEVO and IPI plus chemo alive at three years versus 19% with chemo alone. So these are very important subpopulations, and it gives us a little bit of, you know, um, reassurance when we're treating patients who are pd one negative to know that there really is no statistically significant difference in outcomes for these patients based on pd one expression level. The significance is that you know, we need to treat some patients with chemotherapy. And it's unfortunate, but some of those patients do need chemotherapy. Symptomatic patients, patients with larger burden of disease are typically who oncologists are gonna add chemotherapy for. So to see outcomes in a study where we can actually limit that chemotherapy to only two cycles is very important. And to see good outcomes for those patients, regardless of pd one expression, regardless of histology, it's reassuring to have this as a treatment option for our patients.